from the National Association of Farm Broadcasters National Convention here in Kansas City. It's always great to meet up with some super people, and we do that when we stop by the folks with Monsanto. Luke Samuel, thank you for talking this morning. It's great to visit with you. I always oh. fun to talk a little agriculture. Busy convention this year. You just made a little tour around the uh, convention center. There's lots going on here. Absolutely. Always you know, interesting things to see here. All centered around agriculture, which is great. You got different products, different companies, a lot of fun to get around and visit. We have people here from coast to coast from all across the United States. Luke, you are the corn trait product manager. Let's uh, start with uh, something that we're getting a lot of pressure on or from, and that's rootworms. What are you doing about that? Well, we're, we're talking a lot about corn traits, corn management, and, and obviously pest management. So that's top of mind, especially for those growers across the Midwest, South Dakota being chief among them. And really, what are we doing about corn rootworm? Is it uh, purely trade? Is it getting out in the field? And, and I would answer it's all of those things. It's getting those, uh, getting that information, what's happening in your fields, what's you know some of the factors that are causing some yield loss, and then developing a strategy and implementing those tactics to be successful. All right. Let's talk about uh, where are we heading into the future. Uh, that's always a question, especially this time of the year. Where are we going moving moving ahead? Well, we're really excited. And today we're, we're focused on our Genuity Smart Stacks Rib Complete Corn Blend. It's we got two modes of action for that corn rootworm to really um, slow down and stop that feeding on that root and, and provide that excellent control that growers have come to expect from Monsanto products. And our next generation product is really building on that success today. So. We've had uh, our third generation product, which is scheduled to come out later in the decade, um, out in those fields, those high pressure fields across uh, the Corn Belt. And to date, it looks very, very good. So we're really excited about not only what we have today for options to, to visit with growers about and help them you know, produce more year yield, but also looking forward to the future. And, and you know that research and development never quits. This, this is a challenging pest. It, it will continue to be a challenging pest. All right. Research, uh, development, Monsanto. I got to throw this in. My uh, my wife's uh, mother and family live in Maui, and uh, we travel there every year. And I've been ha I've had the opportunity to uh, see your test center over there in in Maui, where Monsanto does uh, majority of their testing. Right. Well, in, in bringing a new trait to market, it's a long process, and it takes. Uh, input from a lot of different folks and, and having things throughout you know, not only North America but South America and, and as you said out in Hawaii I mean it really allows us to kind of streamline that process and bring those products to market quicker and better understand them so it's it's you know all those now are kind of cogs in the wheel to make sure that we're on the right track and, and bringing those things successfully to market but certainly they're they're at a little better spot for weather wise than what we are today well, they've got the ideal temperatures the overnight temperatures and the afternoon temperatures on a year-round basis to give you the opportunity to test the, the the new technology and so on monsanto a leader in the industry luke samuel thank you for talking with mark us. great to visit with you really appreciate it all right yes for results radio town square media i'm mark tassler in kansas city